Hello my friends and welcome to another video. So today I have really cool uh, like a tutorial of rigging uh, 2D textures into a 3D object. As you can see I have these the eyes. This is, he, uh, this is the worried and you know this is sad this is angry this is angry <laughs> and this is like confused maybe so I have to make mouth shapes as well uh, like so what I have is uh, if I go to a UV editor just like this so and go to hyper shade so as you can see I have three uh, text uh, I have three materials they just have one textures which is this one uh, as you can see on the upper it has uh, eyes and in the bottom it has mouth shapes and as you can see in the beginning I have uh, just painted simple paint in Photoshop so uh, these are like uh, start from nothing start from like uh, you know a girl, just simple color and I have three materials for that first is eyes eyes has just like this area if I go to UV shell like this area has just eyes okay then I have the mouth one and uh, the mouth one I have named it mouth and the whole one is the this yellow body so i have three materials so i can animate the texture so other texture won't be so anyways so anyway guys so what we have to do is i have this uh, made uh, this control this is just a simple curve i parent constraint and scale constraint so i can scale it and do other things as well so first of all I have to go to edit and add attribute so first of all you have to name and I'm gonna go to name I'm gonna go to mouth type in their mouth and minimum to zero and maximum uh, maybe 12 and then add that make sure to integer not factor and yes add that so the eyes are working i'm happy for that with that i tried so many things man so many times i like a trial and error type of situation so you know like a uh, lego like a uh, lego movie everything's awesome everything's flow in the fall of the tree everything's awesome when we live in our dreams i love this song <laughs> so anyways so go to mouth and what I what I do is go to attribute editor okay so select this and go to a mouth because we want mouth uh, so we and we gonna go to this color node place 2d texture and I'm gonna copy this tab okay so I'm gonna place right there right there okay so now uh, we have to offset the UVs as you can see if I press control and press uh, right mouse button and I just uh, drag and drop from left to right side as you can see they are changes the mouth so control Z that anyways so what I have to do is offset so I'm gonna left click sorry right click I always forget sorry so I'm gonna go to set driven key okay select that so this is the set driven key yay I love set driven key I don't know why so select this and load driver select the mouth and when the mouth is zero we want our textures uh, the, that covered so I'm gonna pr uh, press control and offset U and V as well so both can because I have the U is like vertical and V is like a horizontal like uh, 
horizontal sheet. So I'm gonna uh, like check where is the blank. Yes, so that's a blank. Okay. So I'm gonna key that. Oh no. Yes, I'm. <laughs> I'm just curious about guys I tried so many times to get this work right and anyways so if that turned blue that means we have a connection so now mouth zero is blank now I'm gonna uh, press middle mouse button and like drag it so when mouth one shape commit I'm gonna go to like, smiley shape and key that press again to hover over here press control and like this make sure to be in the middle key that go to three uh, okay so that's the shape so now I, I have to go to vertical Oh, he's yawning, right? Like this. Key that again. Four. Now I'm gonna like here. Like, yeah, he's so happy, right? If I just like, it is cutting, right? So that's maybe if I go to 195. Yeah, that's cool. Key that. So now, as you can see, now 5. Ooh. Key that. 6. Uh, maybe I don't have enough mouth shapes. That's weird. Uh, let me check the UV editor. Um, yeah, I have like this shape and this. Yes, I have more. Sorry so much, guys. Six. Yeah, now this is smiling. Six. Now seven. Key that eight key that nine, and I'm going to go like this E. Okay, let's just lower that so I have I think I don't have enough mouth shapes so I'm gonna close that now go to edit and edit attribute so we have like uh, yeah we have nine so I'm gonna go to mouth and press nine so we have restricted the value nine okay so let's animate this I have some kind of keys I'm just delete and yeah I have to show you one more thing as well so first of all this is the simple thing okay I'm gonna key all of thing maybe frame 20 frame hold 21 and 25 he opened his eyes and maybe uh, he's like uh, smiling. Q 
key that and what you have to make sure in mind if I go to windows animation editors graph editor so what you have in mind you don't have these curves to be you know uh, the you don't let's close it and go to this animation tab so you have to make sure that if I scrub in here from 20 to 25 like the the frame in between is changing so what you have to do is drag everything and press this button step tangent so step tangent is like it, ju it just like pop on on the frame and it it's really used in cameras cameras animation so now he's like this maybe go to 35 uh, he's like, like this maybe he's blinking and like this so let's scrub the yeah as you can see like bim he's blinked his eyes and he's open that's really cool <laughs> I mean, I'm really happy that it worked I like you know now he's maybe some other mouth shape yeah that's so cool so he select so now if I see that uh, <laughs> so step tangent that one very step tangent there is step tangent okay so now let's add some rotation like this one okay so select this and go to rotate y so these are keys you know these are graph editor place your place place your marker right here press shift middle mouse button and if you like this so he's can he's gonna rotate okay so we don't want be like these like this one so I'm gonna select everything and hit spline so so it's like this and maybe he's doing like this no I'm really horrible at graph editing to be honest so it like goes here and then he come here here so let's see the final result <laughs> uh, I think when he do like this maybe I have a different eyes that's just my opinion uh, yeah look at that one key that wow that's look cool so yeah guys this was the video I hope you learned something if you have any cool idea to animate 2d texture so you can tell me in the comment so thank you so much for joining me in this video so thank you bye i'm recording on